Hello everybody and welcome to another Codices programming video tutorial. In this video I'm going to talk about set reset coil and RSSR functions in Codices. Suppose that we have a motor and two push buttons for start and uh, stop. We want to uh, turn on the motor. If you press start, the signal will pass to the output and the motor will be turned on. When the motor is turned on, here will be latched and if you release the start button, uh, the motor remains on. It will be stopped when you uh, press the stop push button. This is what we call a self-holding circuit that I have done uh, with codices. A negated contact as stop, type boolean. Normal contact as start and a coil for the motor. In the visualization, I have associated a button with the inputs. And the pilot lamp with the motor. With pressing the start, the motor is on. When I release it, the motor remains on and with pressing the stop button, motor is turned off. Another way to do this uh, project in codices is to use set and reset instruction. Add a new network. You can use this uh, element here or right click and insert the network. Again, we have the normal contact start. Then we insert here a set coil to turn on the motor. You can insert a normal coil, then click on it and select set reset. You will see a little S uh, will appear inside the coil. The difference between a normal coil and a set coil is that even if you release the start push button, set coil will remain on. I add another network with the normal coil to see the difference. Then I'm going to insert the contact stop and the coil. But this time we want to uh, reset the motor. Click two times on the set reset. Whenever I press the start and release it, motor 2 will be on. And if I press the stop button, the reset code will be activated and the motor 2 will be off. Let's test it this time in the simulation with virtual PLC. Make sure uh, your PLC is started. 
click on the device and uh, scan the network it will show you the virtual plc select it download the program to the plc hit yes When you click on start, the motor tool will be on. You see if we release the start button, motor 1 will be off, but motor 2 uh, remains on. That's the difference between normal coil and set coil. If you press the stop button, reset coil will become a logic true. Therefore, the motor will be off. You see both uh, circuits are working in the same behavior. But we can uh, use is still another way to create this circuit. That's by using RS and SR functions. You can find them in the functions block. After inserting the function, we need to define a variable for this uh, function to save its state. Type RS. It will appear here uh, as you can see and here. Next I'm going to insert the SR function. To insert a SR or RS functions we can Insert a box and then write here SR or RS. Declaring a variable. As we see both uh, RS and SR functions have two inputs, set and reset. Let's uh, check the operation of these two function blocks. Now if I change the set to true, the output will be changed to true. And even if I release the start, we see that this function keeps the state and the output is still on. If we want to reset the output or turn off the output, we need to press reset input. So with set, we can make the output on and with reset, make it off. However, the difference between these two functions is that in the SR, the set is dominated. You see, there is a little one after set. It means set is dominated here. And in RS, the reset is dominated. It means uh, if we have both uh, set and reset inputs true, in the SR, output will be true. But in the RS, the output will be false. 
because in RS, reset have more priority. I change here both uh, start and stop to true. Press Ctrl with F7 uh, to write these values. Or from the box, select uh, write values. You can see the output of SR is on, but uh, output for RS is off. Other than that, both uh, functions behave similarly to each other. You can use both uh, RS and SR function to set or reset an output in your program. Okay, that's it for this video. I hope this video helps you understanding set reset code instructions and SRRS functions in codices. Thank you so much for watching this video.